Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we have got some exciting news about the next gen NVIDIA RTX 50 Super Series cars and it's all about faster memory and more choice for NVIDIA. According to the press life, Micron is officially jumping into GDDR7 game for NVIDIA's RTX 50 series, maybe Super too. That means alongside Samsung and Hynix, Micron is also be providing the super fast memory for those next gen GPUs. Micron already announced in 2024 that they will start sampling GDDR7 memory with two speed option 28 Gbps and 32 Gbps using one beta processor technology. The faster 32 Gbps chips are already being introduced, while the 28 Gbps wants still no information from Micron cell rate. So far, Samsung has been dominating the high end RTX 50 cars thanks to better timing and performance. Hynix memory is also being used but mainly for middle to high end cars. Though some partners say Hynix timing are not as good as Samsung's. Now, with the Micron joining Nvidia, has more flexibility and backup in the supply chain. This could help with the production cost, availability, and even possibly give us more price variant depending on which memory is used. Sources says GDDR7 availability will, will play a big role in upcoming RTX 50 Super refresh. Those upgrade models are expected to use 3GB per memory module instead of 2GB which means more VRAM without needing a wider memory bus. It is great to see that competition in memory specs. Micron stepping in would bring better supply and maybe even help bringing price down, especially for gamers like us. But I hope Micron's memory performance is fair with the Samsung, because in past timing and latency different have made a real impact on FPS and on plus and lower. And with the RTX 50 Super refresh coming, Nvidia needs all the memory it can get. So having three solid suppliers is a smart move. I also really curious about the board partner with mix and match memory types on the same model. That could be confusing for buyers if performance varies. What do you think about the Micron joining the GDDR7 race for RTX 50? Are you excited for more variant or are you worried about the performance difference between memory types? Drop your thought in the comment. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell so you never miss the latest GPU news. See you in the next one. Thank you. Free audio post-production by Alphonic.com